All right, people, welcome. This is DEFCON, everybody dies. Um, it's not really a complex strategy game. It's not really technical, any means. It doesn't do anything very well. Um, it's like super, super simple, but the atmosphere is very excellent. Um, I think it's a $10 price point, but should you buy this game? I, I think the demo's enough. Um, the online community isn't really large enough to support you paying for the full game to access some of the functionality it offers you, so um, if you want to just relive um, you know, vicariously live out your Matthew Broderick days, um, pick this up, it's on Steam, you can get the demo, um, but yeah, uh, I'll try to explain a few things, let's, uh, let's add an AI player, and rename him, let's call him Putin, You know what? I think the nukes will go under Clinton. There we go. She'll she'll probably nuke Putin. Let me make it fair. All right. Uh, so the game is super simple. You basically just gather your force and uh, kill as many um, civilians nuclear installations, whatever, what have you, on the opposing team. I'm going to slow this down and try to explain stuff. Um, so you have metropolitan areas that you want to protect. Your silos serve both as a base to launch your ICBMs, and they also, when they're not shooting uh, nukes out, their anti-air defenses. So it's very important um, you protect your most densely populated cities. And I'm going to try to do that. Um, they work really well when you have a good uh, good knowledge of what's incoming. So you can kind of see the range they can defend the incoming nukes. You want to put radar dishes up to give you that little extra heads up. Put this here because really I just want a bit of a bit of time before it's probably going to go down. Um, Uh, sorry, I'm doing multiple things. It's probably not very in depth. Um, and aircrafts will, uh, air bases help you defend against uh, a naval assault. Let's try to keep it around here. Should be enough to get me. I think most of the combat's gonna take place here, but we'll see. Um, and put one and try to move my nuclear subs out of the way.
these are weaker, I'll put them back. And, uh, yeah, once you get to DEFCON 3, I believe you can, uh, start a war, but you're not allowed to launch the nukes until DEFCON 1. speed things up. You just sit back and try to kill the most highly populated cities. Alright. We can go all up in here. That's good. It looks like they're distracted so I'm going to try to move. Slow time down so I can launch all my bombers. These guys are actually kind of weak, so I want to keep them away from what's going on here. I want to send as many fighters out as I can to destroy this fleet. Because if they're dead, that means I can... And they're obliterating me. Got. Send a scouting guy ahead. It's mostly a nuclear submarine game. It's where, where it's at. I'm trying to position these like right below South Korea and uh, hopefully that will be out of range. time for the nuclear volley to fly. It's pretty exciting. Let's see where their subs are positioned. Should have some fighters scouting because I'm pretty sure they're they're moving up right outside of Los Angeles to just nuke me. Speed things up a bit. Who doesn't want to see the end of the world? So uh, yeah this I mean, it's just a very, the games are some light naval combat that you have minimal control over. Uh, just kind of roll the dice, who wins, I mean the more battleships the better. Um, but other than that, there's not too much to it. Need to keep sending bombers out. they're out and usually they can get most of the the subs once they launch I can send all my uh, bombers back we'll see what happens Giving me some uh, free reign on what to do. I assume they got a airbase. Luckily, I'm in my the safety of my uh, 
nuclear silo bunker waiting for the president's command. I'm gonna hopefully get these subs out because once uh effective range of the nukes are. That's not that great. Let's try to move it up a little bit closer. That's about all I can do right now. So I want to move through. That might give me a bit better range, but it's going to take a while. So they're probably positioning their team right there. Putin has launched. There we go. Alright, so he's given away the position of his silos. I'm going to immediately attempt to counter everything. One, two, three, four. So the more I can hit before he gets off, the less likely he is to... If I can get all of these off, even though I can't hit a ton, that's two fewer groups of ten nukes he's going to be sending my way. Kind of need the subs uh, as a countermeasure to his nuclear installations this timing low. Um, so I guess I really only have fighters to launch. And then a bunch of bombers to try and hit the installation. This one is probably the best target. Hopefully, I'll teach him a lesson. But it looks like I am not going to be able to scout in time to kill anyone in their nuclear volley. Luckily, I haven't given away my defensive locations, but LA is pretty much dead. They may know where this one is. All right. Let's speed it up, see what's going on. Putin is just rocking. Let's see how well he does. Hmm, I got, I got the silo down. That was, uh, was pretty good. These bombers can go a long way, so we'll see if I can hit them. Got some nukes incoming. Should be able to handle them. 
hoping I can protect New York, but you know, if DC goes down, who cares? Oh, wow. I'm getting rocked. They can't really defend too much, so I just need to pick off what I want to hit. Oh, what am I doing? They can resupply if they make it back, but I don't think they will. Looks like the major volley is done, so it's going to be my turn. Oh, what victory timer started already? I think that's when over 80% of all nukes launch. Got one of my... kill every city that doesn't have people dying. Already got hit. Did not get hit. Did not get hit. Get them all. Let's kill them extra dead. See who wins. Doing pretty good. Alright. Engage. Dang it. Uh, rain more hell on Leningrad. Well, looks like I won. I don't think their arsenal is going to do more damage than what this is currently going to do. That's right, Putin. Suck it. what happens when they come in one at a time. Slowly picking off.
Man, silos are doing good. Yay. Yeah, I definitely lost the Battle of the Pacific. But otherwise, save DC in New York. And that's why I won right there. 22 million still left alive. They only hit half of Chicago. So I'm fine with that. Well, thank you for watching. Like I said, uh, you can get the demo. It's a nice 15, 20 minutes. Killed some time.